Let us speak of Li Si. Li Si was a political philosopher and noted calligrapher during China's Qin Dynasty. He served as Prime Minister between 246 and 208 BC and ruled with an iron fist. Once to quell a protest by Confucian scholars, he ordered 460 of them to be buried alive. And he developed a form of execution known as the Five Punishments, where each new one was worse than the last. It began with a forehead tattoo, ended with being cut in half, and somehow involved the nose and feet and castration in between. Ew. And having offered these mutilations to advance the field of corporal punishment, Li Si received it. In an episode of courtly intrigue that involved a eunuch, a treason charge, and a talking chimpanzee sidekick, JK, Li Si was punished five ways. Death by your own invention. It's a cruel kind of irony, a second-hand suicide. And like an enduring Frankenstein tale, it has been rewritten many times in the century since Mr. Li. The Muslim scholar Ishmael bin Hamad al-Jahari secured an eternal Wikipedia entry when he leapt from a mosque with the two wooden wings he had invented, flapped them and died shortly after the year 1000. Or the fourth Earl of Morton, James Douglas, who introduced the Maiden, a kind of primitive guillotine to Scotland, then was killed by the Maiden in 1581 for his role in a murder. Or Franz Reichert, the Parisian tailor who leapt from the Eiffel Tower in a homemade parachute suit in 1912. The suit did not function as planned. And now modernity has added a new twist, death by invented persona. Take the three Marlboro men who have died of lung cancer over the years, puffing the product they posed for. Or Steve Irwin, an Australian animal lover who died as the crocodile hunter in front of a video camera among dangerous sea creatures. So why speak of this now? Charlie Sheen. The man's newest incarnation of himself as a tiger-blooded megalomaniac has slayed his old self's career, trading television screens for computer screens, and is now exhausting his welcome here. Is anyone charmed by winning anymore? It's been weeks, and we're ready to move on. Perhaps to this, a beat down by invention. It's the Casey Hines video, a bully being bullied by the boy he bullied. What? Sonic Boom.